What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You're here with Brody yet again. Kelsey is still in Las Vegas getting ready for her first preseason game that's actually coming up very soon, this weekend. Uh, this Sunday, I believe. Is it Saturday? Sunday? I can't remember exactly. I'll be flying in, going to watch the game with Silver Sage. It will be a fun time for sure. And then Kelsey will be back. And she might be doing some solo videos herself because I've got a couple of big tournaments coming up. So we'll see if we're both in town at the same time. But today, boy, oh boy, do we have a massive product for you today. 2020. Whenever there's 2020 on the table, you know it's a big boy product. Why, you might ask? Well, the QBs is really what moves the market. Yes, we know that Puka. We know people love Bijan. We know people love... Uh, well, I'm blanking on other people. See, that's how you know. Um, the QBs is what pushes the market, though. Right now, yes, there are some rookies that are hot that aren't QBs. But if you kind of follow the trend year after year and you look at prices and how they operate, it's very hard for non-QBs uh, to kind of have their market continue to rise. It's, uh, there's very few people that can do it. So it's all about the QBs, especially when you're going back and opening old wax. And this one, 2020 is a massive class. Burrow, Tua, Herbert, Hertz, and oh man, I'm going to forget one and they're going to get really mad. Wow, Jordan Love, excuse me, apologies. Sorry to all my Packer fans out there. That's on me. Uh, five major QBs and we're ripping into some mosaic value packs. Very difficult to find 2020 product that is not crazy expensive. Uh, this is a $400 box, but you do get 12 packs. So if you do the math real quick, let's do some quick math. 400 divided by 12. That means each value pack is $13. Uh, you can get a value pack right now of Mosaic probably for like of this class with Stroud, AR, Levis, for like 19 bucks, 18 bucks, 17 bucks. So this is almost twice as expensive of a product as what you're looking at right now. So it is definitely a pricey rip. So like all of our rips, if you guys can, drop a like down below. We do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, welcome, welcome. Click the subscribe button, it's completely free and you get uh, notified of when we post more videos. And uh, the more likes, the more videos. So we do appreciate it. And uh, we get to open some cool product that we've never opened before right here on the channel with some pink. What do you guys think of the pink? A little bit different, huh? 2020 mosaic with the pink. Mahomes on the front. Let's see what all we can pull on the back here. Uh, even though it's a value pack, it does look like that's going to be really small for you guys. But even though it's a value pack, it does look like there's a lot of stuff that we can pull. The Genesis obviously is in here, which is great. Blue mosaic, uh, blue fluorescent out of 15. That would be a massive card. Um, it looks like that's really the only number cards that you're looking for. Blue fluorescent out of 15 on a lot of different inserts as well. And you can pull autos and gold autos, which is kind of nutty. So a lot of cool things that we can pull out of here. And hopefully today we do. Hopefully pull. So we are going to be ripping these until we pull a good QB. So not a base QB, a good QB card, and then we will stop for the day. They also did this thing too where it's like two packs. So you have, you have these two packs, and then you have your bonus pack. So three packs per value pack. Kind of makes it a little bit more fun, and uh, we'll check it out. Before we get into it though, holy crap. Last night, this is what I've been telling you guys. Whether you want to get in our breaks or not on whatnot, that is completely fine. But let me show you this clip because this was the final giveaway. I think we ended up doing like seven or eight giveaways at the very end of the night. This was the final giveaway and this is what they hit. So like you can see there, whether you're in the breaks or you're just lurking in the chat, it's an absolute blast over on whatnot. You never know what's going to happen with me too. I sometimes get in these crazy moods where I just give away a bunch of product or 
Uh, we also auctioned off, I think, a $250 box, and it went for like $140 or something, $150, so $100 off. You never know what's going to happen over there, but I do enjoy everyone that is over there. Now, I have no idea what I'm looking for, quite frankly, guys, so we are all going to be in this together. I know the players. I got to tell you, these look clean. I don't know the look of the cards. But that looks nice. I don't know what kind of prism that is. But that is a cool looking mosaic there. And a little Palomalu as well on the back. All right, so it looks like these are going to be kind of like mini blaster packs. Of where it's just a lot of base cards. And then there's like one parallel. And then I have no idea what's in the bonus pack. But I got to say, these do look clean. And that's going to be a Jordan Hicks on the green mosaic and the Flea Flicker. That's kind of a cool card. Stafford, Sanders, and Calvin Johnson. And there's our first rookie. All right, Jalen Rager. Not a bad rookie at all out of the Eagles. He didn't really probably pan out the way that maybe people thought he was going to be. But first rookie, we'll take it. We are looking for those big rookie quarterbacks. All right, let's see what's in this thing. Oh, okay, these are the pink camos. Pink camos are in these. Very nice. So let's see if we can find something here. Is this light okay, guys? There we go. I think that's better. Pink camos. Brian Dawkins. And one rookie, Anthony McFarland Jr. Okay, so it looks like after opening up one of these packs, we're going to get hopefully one pink camo rookie and potentially one or two rookies in the other packs as well. How big of a set is this? 300 card set. All right, 300 card set. So it's not a massive set. So we should be able to pull like at least one of the big QBs. Now the question is, what do we pull it on, right? Do we just pull a base one? That's a couple, you know, 20, 30 bucks and a 10. Or do we pull a... a parallel that might be 60 bucks there's a josh jacobs clyde edwards all right because if you can get them in a 10 on dude what is have you guys been noticing this with some of these sleeves man super cheaply made like i can just run through these i bought these from bcw and uh i don't know i feel like they're not nearly as strong as some of the other ones so I don't know if I'm going to buy them from them anymore. I mean, they're fine once the card is in there. But I have noticed that they're just easy to rip like that. There is a Josh Allen. Unfortunately, not one of the rookies here. You got to go back a few more years. 2018 is his rookie class. But that is uh, that is one of the rookies. And we will take it. It is just a base. But I believe this is my first time ever pulling a Joe Burrow. Uh, on the base and wow that is uh that is something that i'm gonna keep it because i'm probably gonna send this off to psa because i just want to slap it up my first burrow gotta show some respect and slap it up we'll put the slab up pile up there so far burrow's the only one in the slab up pile wow second pack already hitting a burrow i did say we're ripping though until i pull a big qb um, that's just the base. So we got we got to get do better. We got to do better. James Conner and Patrick Queen. All right, still in his LSU gear. Interesting. Uh, he looks to be the only only rookie so far that we've pulled that is in college unis. I wonder why that is. Um, Mosaic does seem to like come out late enough, usually for them to. Uh, man, what do you guys think? Going back to 2020, do you guys want us to try to go back and rip? We're kind of in a lull right now. We have um, our big show this week is going to be on Wednesday, release day of Contenders Optic and Optic H2. We'll have a uh, release party over on Whatnot, and I'll be opening those as well when I get them in here for you guys on YouTube so you can see if you want to go buy some of those or not. Um, but what do you guys think? Going back in time and opening... Some older, De uh, Devin Singletary opening some, and Adrian Peterson, look at that touchdown. Some older product, LaVisca Chenault Jr. Okay. I like it. I'm a big fan of it for the, if the price is right, you know, if the price is, uh, you know, a little on the steep side, it is a little scary, 
But if you can get the price right, it is fun going back and ripping some older product. It definitely is fun. Darren Waller, no longer. We got a red here. Now it's going to be Randy Moss on the red and green. That is not numbered, but that is a cool card. And hey, Tom Brady, you can't pull Tom Brady in 2023 product. So that's kind of cool. Probably worth a dollar or so, but no Tom Brady cards in any 2023 product. So that's nice. All right, Matt Ryan is going to be there. We got a Josh, Jason Taylor, and a Chase Claypool on the NFL debut. So it is an insert. Inserts aren't nearly worth as much as the true rookie cards. For those that are wondering, if people say, like, that's his true rookie, they're talking about this, where it's literally just the base rookie card, where this is an insert because it says NFL debut, right? So true rookies definitely go more. You know, if you get a true rookie color, it's going to be worth more, more valued than a insert with color. Just so you guys know, a little tidbit of info for you. What if we pull an auto out of here? I wonder who signs in mosaic. All right, we have our first silver mosaic here. So there's two types of mosaic, uh, two types of silver mosaic. This one is the mosaic mosaic, if you will, of where it is. It's got the the usual design, and then true silver is going to look like this, and then just be your normal silver look. Which those again also go for a nice little penny if you get it on the right player. Uh, another Josh Jacobs and a T. Higgins. Okay. T. Higgins. We might slab Mr. T. Higgins up as well with Joe Burrow and his teammate up there. Again, all the Bengal rookies so far. No other rookies want to come out to play just yet. Chancellor, Cook, Vaughn Miller, Mack, Thurman Thomas on the old school. And how about a Tua on the NFL debut? All right, now they're starting to fly. We'd love to see it. The nice thing about, or the cool thing about the 2020 draft class, I mean, the reason why this is so expensive, guys, is because if you pull a blue fluorescent out of 15 of any of those five QBs, that pays for the box and more. So the, uh, the chance of pulling a massive card here is high when you have five big QBs. That's why the price is what it is. Um, but we can kind of nickel and dime our way back. We really can. I'll, I'm going to do a little breakdown maybe at the end and kind of give you an idea of where I think we're going to end up if we do nickel and dime all these. Hall of Fame. Jerome Bettis. So that's not really what we want to see there. We want that to be a rookie. We don't want that to be an insert at the end. We really want to see a rookie in that bonus pack. We don't have too many hits of that bonus pack, so... Don't want to waste it with an insert. All right. Bosa, Hunter. There's Cooper trying to, and Jason Taylor on the color match. Cooper was almost maybe going to be a 49er. Got game, Michael Thomas. Bucks. Tyler Johnson. All right. Well, that's how you also know if, the, if, if someone's name doesn't pop out when you pull their card, well, it's probably because uh, they're no longer... No longer in the league or, you know, somewhere deep into the depth chart or on the practice squad or something like that. All right. The King himself, Eli Manning, Vic, Kenny Galladay, another Derrick Henry, and a Hall of Fame. All right. Kevin Green. So we haven't pulled really any good color yet rookies. Any good color rookies. Chase Claypool, Queen, and uh, Anthony McFarland. So... We're striking out a little bit on the color. We have three nice base rookies over there. Two of those are the two of the big quarterbacks. Can we find some nice color here? Fournette on the front. Carson Wentz, oh Lord. This is back when he was in his camo days. Rookie. Raider? Brian Brian Edwards. All right, talk about someone that did not pan out. Brian Edwards there for the Raiders. Man, the Raiders... Talk about like going on a streak. Has any other team gone on a worse streak of basically like drafting wide receivers and then just like not being good? I know someone was saying the Brown did the Browns do that for a little bit? There was another team that was that was up there and drafting wide receivers 
like sexy wide receiver picks at the beginning and they just never turned out. Raiders are definitely close to the top of the list there. Lawrence Taylor, Keenan Allen, Calvin Johnson, and how about a Patrick Mahomes? We'll take it. We'll take it. Any Mahomes is a good Mahomes. And talk about a guy that stock is going up. A little Kyler Murray there on the flea flicker. And I see D Lamb. Very nice. This is like a $40 to $60 car in a PSA 10. Somewhere in that range, I believe. Might be a little bit lower. Well, uh, I'll, I'll throw up for like stuff like this. Oh, I'm going to slab that up. Why am I putting it in the top litter? Stuff like this too. Guys, I, I will throw up the PSA 10s. I'll put it on there, PSA 10s, um, to kind of show you what we're going for if we slab these up, just to give you a little bit of value. Because obviously when you're hunting back in 2020, you're not going to sell these cards raw. You're going to try to get the value out of them and send them in. Because there's no risk. You know, you're not trying to be first on the market with a raw card. All right, there is our true silver. So this could be an absolute nuke if it's one of the big boys. This could be an absolute nuke if it's a big boy. Jim Kelly Hall of Fame. That's fine. Get him out of the way. Come on. Show me Rook. We see Rook. Colts. Adam Vinatieri. All right. Interesting. Adam Vinatieri there. Not who we're looking for. One of the greatest kickers of all time, though. But, you know, not a rookie. Not going to do much. Cool card, though. Like I said, those true civil, silvers. Man, are they beautiful. All right, Mr. Mark Brunel. That's my quarterback when I first. We're going to have an NFL debut, it looks like, rookie. I'll take it. Oh, Pro Bowl. Mark Andrews. So another pack there with no rookies. All right. We're going to need... We're going to need some fire here, boys. Come on. Show me one Jordan Love. Show me one Herbert. Show me one. All right, we do have a silver mosaic. Not going to be rookie. That's going to be Lawrence Taylor. Khalil Mack and Jake Fromm. If you squint, it kind of looks like kind of looks like him. <laughs> It kind of looks like him if you squint hard enough. Talking about J uh, Josh Allen there, but all right, Jake Fromm, another guy that really didn't pan out. Did you guys watch the? Um, did you guys watch that Netflix show he was on? Spencer Rattler was on it. He was on it. Uh, who else was it? It was like QB One, I think, is what it was called. Pretty good. Pretty good. Just a lot of those guys did not pan out. You know, they were the man and. Everyone loved them in, in high school, and then they just kind of fizzled out once they got to the next league. AJ Green, monster. Old school Brett Favre, cool looking card, and Hall of Fame Jerome Bettis. All right, bonus pack. We need something here. Pink Camo Me. That's a nice little Travis Kelsey. That's very nice. We'll take it. Dalvin Cook. MVP, all right, and Mahomes. You know? We'll take two. We'll take it. If you're not going to give me a rookie, I'll take Mahomes every time. Mahomes sells really good. People like him. So we will take it. Cool card, too, with the Travis Kelsey. Maybe even, I might even list both of those together on eBay. Definitely check out our eBay guys and uh, whatnot as well. We put cards on both eBay and whatnot for you guys. So. All right, we are getting down to it. We got five left. Yeah, five left. So it does. Uh, it does look like we might be ripping. Um, it does look like that we might be ripping this entire this entire box. I didn't know if that was going to be the case, but it does look like it right now. Unless we pull something big right here. How about a boomer size? So that's not going to get done. Patrick Mahomes and a C.J. Henderson again. Also not. Uh, a little rookie there for the Gators. Go Gators, but not going to be um, in his jersey either. Interesting. But a touchdown of Patrick Mahomes there. Touchdown Masters, Patrick Mahomes. Cool card. Their touchdown Masters, definitely I like these a lot more than the, the big heads that they had. You know? All right. Oh, I almost went for another pack. Here we go. Mm, tiki. More 
DJ Moore, Green of Got Game, Ryan Tannehill. No, thank you. J.K. Dobbins. All right, for my Buckeyes. I like it. I'll keep that one. Very nice. I hope he can, you know, find his, his role in his spot. Stay healthy, man, you know. Stay healthy. Tough to do nowadays with being the running backs. They do just run you into the ground, but... All right, show us a pink rookie. One time, Mr. Dick Buckkiss, one of Kelsey's favorite players. Hall of Fame again, John Elway. Dang. All right, down to our last four here, folks. Down to our last four. It's getting down to the nitty-gritty. Are you scared yet? Did I just throw $400 down the tube? I don't know. If you're still watching, shout out all my Tadpole gang. You know who you are. Appreciate you. Drop a like down below. You guys have been liking our videos recently. And it's definitely been helping out. It's on the debut, but oh boy. That's the best card we've hit. And that's, it's not even close. Best card we've hit and it's not even close. Jalen Hurts, color match, green mosaic on the NFL debut. Heck yeah. That is sick. That's, I want more, though. I want more. We're ripping more. It is too fun. I can't stop. I can't stop. Got to go more. That's sick. All right, so we've hit a Burrow. We've hit a Tua. We hit a Hertz. We're looking for Herbert, and we're looking for Love. Herbert and Love. Can we get all five? We're like, I'm freaking, uh, what's his name? What's that guy's name? Uh, oh, my gosh. Avengers. Uh, I'm Thanos. I'm freaking Thanos trying to go around and get my uh, get all my stones. All right, silver coming up. This could be massive. Come on. On the back. Jonathan Taylor. That's not bad on the debut. Rook. Not a rook. Jerry Rice on the true silver. The card. Card looks so good. Give me a rookie on it. I wonder if it needs to be the final card for it to be a rookie. Because so far, the rookies have always been the last card in the pack. Um, but the silver, no, I don't think so. I think the silver is always going to be in that slot. You, you just have to get lucky for it to be a rookie. All right, here we go. Roquan Smith, Rod Wilson, Woodson, show me rookie here. Yes. Who? Colts? Jonathan Taylor. We'll take it. I told you, not bad. We'll sleeve it up, slab it up on the pink mosaic. Heck yeah. Love it. All right, now we're rocking and rolling. We got three left. I think we might be getting close to like 150 back is what I'm going to guess. I think maybe if they all gym. Now, obviously, the, the chances of all of them gymming, gymming, very, very slim, very slim. But, you know, you got to you gotta live on the – you got to live on the high side. There's a Chase Young. I might slab that up too. What the heck? I don't care. Freaking Chase Young. Saquon Barkley, there's my guy, Crosby, monster. And a Roquan Smith, another Roquan Smith there with an old school uh, John Elway. All right, this class is insane. This 2020 class is insane. If you guys have $400 to spend to rip on some stuff, this is not a bad, bad rip, honestly. Like Prism... Uh, for 2020 is like 2000 something ridiculous. So Nick Chubb, my Chubb. So if you don't got the money to drop on 2k, which let's be honest, who really has the money to drop a $2,000 for a box? That seems a little silly. Maybe go here. This might not be a bad, bad. All right. We might have a debut. We do have a debut. Okay, we do have a rook on the back. Chief. Clyde Edwards. All right, Clyde Edwards. Not the guy we're looking for there in that spot. At least it was on the mosaic. All right, last two, guys. Last two. Come on. Love me. Love me. And show me a herb. Show me a herb and show me a love. To end the video. Yeah, I have Dwayne Haskins, RIP. Also, go Buckeyes.
That's why you rip this stuff. That is why you rip wax. That is why you rip wax. I don't know why it's foggy. I'm sorry. My camera's foggy. Let me see if I can clean it. Quick clean job. Foggy camera. Lens. Let's see. Is it still foggy? Am I back? Are we back? Let's see. Foggy or good? I think it's a little bit better. Cheese. That's another one. Love it. Jimmy G. Wow. What a pack. What a pack. Another Hertz. This time on the base. What a pack. Wow. This box is juicy. I got to think this box is juicy, right? Come on. We got to be getting close now. We got to be getting close. Find one more big one for the boy. One more big one for the boy. Clyde. Man, they love this guy. They love this guy in this product. Clyde. Clyde the dried. All right. Can we find a little pink love? A little pink mosaic love for the one time. We have a debut. Okay, we do have Rook. It is a debut, but I'll take it. I like the colors. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. What a box! What a box! What a box! Oh, what a box! All right. Here we go. Last pack. Man, that, this has been great. I went from having no 2020 rookies quarterbacks. I think it's the first time we've ever ripped 2020 on the channel. I think it is. We've ripped some 2020 in, uh, in breaks, but I think this is the first time we've ever ripped it on the channel. I got to tell you, it's going pretty good, guys. It's going pretty good. Terry Bradshaw, Kirk Cousins, Staubach, Brown, and how about another Patrick Mahomes got game? I'll take it. And another Jalen Rieger. All right, this time on the base. I think, oh no, debut, NFL debut. We had him on the base previously. This time he's on the base, now, uh, on the debut. All right, and another Patrick Mahomes. These, I'm curious what the value of these are. I'm thinking that any Patrick Mahomes cards 2020, I'm thinking that these are at least three bucks. That is my bet. They might be even more, but I, I, my safe bet's like a $3 card. So you just chip away, you know, three, four, five Patrick Mahomes cards. You're looking at, you know, 14, 15, something like that dollars. We'll see though. I'll look up comps at the end. All right, we got one more green. Going out with one more green. And we have a rook on the back that's a yellow rook. Could be is Chargers yellow? I don't know. Philip Lindsley, not who we're looking for. Eli Manning, not who we're looking for. Steelers. Anthony McFarland Jr. once again. Steelers, I don't know why I said that. Chargers are gonna be a light blue. I don't know why I thought they might have used the, the little bit of yellow that's the accent color in the Chargers uniform as the rookie shield. I was maybe just hoping. Show me Rook on the back. And it looks like maybe it's an eagle. And it looks like it maybe is an eagle. What a box! What a box! What a box! What a box! Wow. Holy crap. I think we got there, guys. I don't even think I need these to all gym. I don't even think I need all these to gym. I think we might have got there. Hurts on the pink. Hurts on the NFL debut. Base Hurts. Burrow on the mosaic debut. Chase Young. Jonathan Taylor on the pink. Hurts on the NFL debut green. CD Base. Two on the debut, T. Higgins base, and Burrow on the debut. I don't, I'm very curious to look up these comps. You guys know right now whether or not we got close or not. $400. Um, but th this is the thing, though, guys. Even if it comes out and I'm like, oh, wow, if all these gym and I sell all these over here, I only made 200 bucks. This was so much fun to rip. This was so much fun to rip. So that's what it's all about at the end of the day. I, I always tell people there's obviously way different ways to enjoy uh, sports cards. I love the thrill of chasing and opening big cards and then 
holding the my favorite ones and rooting for those players. And obviously not it's not for everyone, but if you have the money and you're okay with it, then this to me is like the most fun is you buy a pack and whether you get crap or not, you still have a good time. That's why I love breaks. That's why I love ripping here on the YouTube channel with you. Kelsey's the same way. We just, we love ripping cards. We love chasing for them. And uh, oh, by golly, that was a fun one. That I, We might have to run that back with something else. Post in the comments what 2020 product we should open next on the channel. Thanks so much for watching. See you this Wednesday night. Optic Contenders release day. Optic H2 release day happening over on Whatnot. See you there. Keep ripping them packs.